Ma? I did an x-ray and this is the result I got. Can you translate it? Let me see. Later. Come on, that's me. Wow. Yes, come on, that's me. Wow. A 
8.01 p.m. Oh my days, wrong of worry to your love. Twelve o'clock midnight. Mama, I'm going out. I will see you when I get back, okay? Bye bye. The next morning. Mama, good morning. Uh uh. You are eating. Mama, I've told you to reduce the food you eat. Don't you like your health? Eh? I've told you too much food can increase the mucus in your lungs. Hmm? Mama, I need the five hundred dollars now. It's inside my bag, in my room. Okay, ma. A few minutes later. One. Two. Three, four, Jesus is Lord. Five, six, seven, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, seventy one, seventy two, seventy three. 74 75 100 101 102 103 Mama get up get up get up get up 104 105 Later that same evening But I don't have cough I need to go to the hospital. Yes. I need to go to the hospital. A few moments later. Coming. Good evening, doctor. Good evening, madam. Please sit down. Thank you. So, madam, how may I help you? Doctor, I did an x-ray and I showed it to my son, who is also a doctor. Can I see the x-ray? Of course, doctor. From what I can see here, you have cystic fibrosis. Doctor, I know. Cystic what? Fibrosis. 
With all due respect, madam, you don't have cystic fibrosis. Do I have worse? No, madam. You don't have worse. From what I can see here, you have perfectly healthy lungs. As healthy as... Doctor, please! Check it again! The person who told you you have cystic fibrosis doesn't know what to say or is lying. You have perfectly healthy lungs, madam. You're supposed to be happy. Is everything okay? Seriously? Mama, do you want to exercise now? I am just coming from the hospital. Oh! Now you are shocked. Mama, why did you go to the hospital? Because it is not part of the principles you lied about. At all, oh. meaning a child that says that his parents will not sleep at night will not sleep at all. Bringing you this report live from an African home as a woman is charged and accused of burying her own son alive. Report says that she was provoked because of the stupidity of her son. Please watch. Thank you, so madam. Do you regret your actions? I do not regret my actions. I don't. So don't ask me that kind of question. If you have the kind of son that I have, then you will know exactly why I do not regret my actions. Because it's always like, Mama, this is trendy. Mama, that is trendy. Well, this news is also trendy. There is a proverb that says, when a house rat starts calling itself bush rat because it is getting fat, then it has started passing its boundary and needs to be stopped. All I can say is God give it and God take it. To God be the glory. Thank you. There you have it, my people. Thank you for tuning with us on One African News Channel. We'll see you again next week. God bless. <laughs>